over a nine-year-old boy has been shot and killed. Very violent and bloody 24 hours. From 6 a.m. yesterday to 6 a.m. this morning, 13 people were shot in eight So is violence every day coming in every way. We don't know what to say, so we pray to the Creator for peace and healing because we're feeling some type of way. He sends an answer and it's nothing new, calling for me, calling for you to come together now through Code 22. That's each 22nd, one day to our knees for his call to us says, may I have your attention, please? I have your peace, I have your healing. But are you willing to stop dealing through earthly measures, earthly treasures for just one day and hear what I have to say? Some have listened and some have heard and some have thought it's absurd for politicians and preachers and laborers and teachers to honor this code so bold. Students, inmates, state reps and popo all say the chill of this murder is much too cold to continue. So churches are opening their venue on the 22nd for a night of peace and healing. Are you willing to unite if not with them then in your own way against the killing? Code 22 asks for you and your circle of influence to do something different that day. Pray, forgive, and say honor the code today. Throw up two fingers on both hands. It means Code 22 is where we stand. Murder is a voice that must be silenced. And it can begin with a day of no violence. Holler at us, gang bangers and boys in the hood. We need you the most on this day. What's good? Make it happen. If not for you, then the kids. A day of rest, no stress, no test. One day of no violence. And let's see how it feels to be blessed. Well, you can see behind me, it's still a very active scene. Uh, we saw homicide. Uh Crime scene services pull up just about five minutes ago. We were told there were four kids total inside the house when this happened while an adult stepped out.